So today we're gonna to take a look at a water bottle pouch. Now we've made a water bottle pouch for a long time. We've sort of updated it this year. And basically what you've got is thousand denier Cordura. It's got a four inch piece of Velcro on it. So you can obviously add patches, name plates, whatever you want like that. It's again, thousand denier Cordura bottom. It's got Molly straps in the back so you can hook it to any of our panels. It's got two loops. So if you wanted to add a carry strap to it, you can, or you just wanna clip it to something. You can just clip it to something. Got a little pull cord here and it's lined with a 70 weight nylon. So it's a lighter weight piece. It goes a lot of places. It's just a pretty handy piece. And one of the things that we made this for is we wanted to make something that held a lot of different stuff kind of functionally. So it'll obviously cover two life-size squirrels. Uh, Bob may be a little smaller than full life-size, so uh, sort of maybe slightly bigger than a chipmunk, but absolutely one life-size squirrel in Bob. From there, you can get things like propane tanks fit in it really well, 40 ounce Yeti, same thing. Height wise, it's built sort of around the 40 ounce water bottle size. The top of the pouch will kind of grab the lip of the water bottle, right? So you've got stuff that size, you've got 32 ounce Nalgene. And my favorite part of this, so on the 32 ounce Nalgene, it actually goes clear to the lid so that when you, when you close it, you've got it securely in there. My favorite thing about this is we made it big enough so that we'll actually hold the wipes, like Clorox wipes and stuff like that, the big tube canisters, so you can actually sit this in there and you can take something like, you can mount that to the back of the seat panel, right? And you can either clip it on the webbing, right? You can clip it against the webbing or you can actually use the, the Molly Pals platform to actually snap it into it without any trouble. So it gives you the versatility of having something that, yeah, it'll give you an extra drink holder on the back of the seat. If you put it on the passenger seat, again, sort of arms reach of the driver, which is pretty handy. So I can keep a drink in here. If I don't have a lot of, a lot of drink storage or cup storage, it'll hold a bunch of different size cups. Or if I want to use that Clorox wipes container, stuff like that, I can easily put that in here, slide it down, tighten it, open the lid and be pulling wipes out of it pretty much all day long. It doesn't have any insulation in it, it's just a container because at this point we've got so many good water bottles, double walled insulated water bottles, that the insulation kind of becomes a moot point. So we actually built sort of a heavier duty bag, a bag that's more abrasion resistance and sort of take a better beating, but we we took out the padding of it so that we don't have to worry about the, the space that the padding takes up. It gives us a little bit more room and again, we've kind of got a heavier built sort of cover for it. But that's the uh, Blue Ridge water bottle pouch. This is probably the Gen 3-ish or 4. I don't even know what gen this is on. Um, but like I said, we've kind of upgraded it over the years and, and changed it. But that's it. New water bottle pouch. Check it out at BlueRidgeRivelingGear.com. Thanks for taking the time to stop and look. Mm -hmm.